strongest man competition kicked off today. And that competition is going to air on CBS in June, but News 13's Maya Lockett spent today behind the scenes speaking with contestants about the mental and the physical preparation it takes to compete. Organizers told me they chose Myrtle Beach because it was a beautiful location to host the 46th annual Strongest Man in the World competition. It's a great day to be Bobby Thompson. Bobby Thompson is one of 30 men from around the world competing in this year's World Strongest Man competition. Thompson is representing the USA. Over the next few days, the men will be pushed to their physical and mental limits, competing in a series of events, including a loading race, go Rondo, let's go. Go. pulling a car, lifting a deadlift machine, and a kettleball toss. It's about losing your mind the day before and then gaining control the day of. There are contestants from all over the world, including a Ukrainian competitor who was living in Ukraine during the war while training. Australia, Africa, and Europe bringing their family, friends, and fans to Myrtle Beach. They are putting their bodies through hell, and but they are doing it in such a fun and competitive atmosphere that you just you just love every second of it. The Myrtle Beach Area Chamber of Commerce and organizers said ticket sales thus far for the five-day event has exceeded their expectations. We've seen this incredible fan base develop year over year. And then we really, you know, reached out via social and these guys have great platforms on their own. And so it's been incredible to just watch this event blossom and really come into its own. The winner of the competition will be announced this Sunday and they will win that strongest men in the world title and a few thousand dollars. Reporting in Myrtle Beach, Maya Lockett, News 13.